Hey, we're here uh, in Orlando, Florida at Vectors 2019, that is SkySwitch's user conference. Uh, joining me this afternoon, we're closing in on the end of day one, here with Andy Abramson, who's handling marketing duties as a CMO for SkySwitch. Andy, good to see you. Good to see you always, and good to see all the TMC team, Eric. This has been, when I say one heck of a day, first day of our conference, started last night with a wonderful reception, but oh, what a day today was. We started it off, I mean, there seemed to be, when I got in here, there seemed to be a lot of people here. More people than last year. So last year, Vectors was in Nashville at the Gaylord, and we had about 180 people. We've got close to 350. So we almost doubled the crowd, a lot more resellers, a lot of new resellers, and some old resellers who may not have been to Vectors since the first year, four years ago. So we're really happy with the turnout. But what's really been great is just the receptiveness of everybody all day long. Well, and frankly, um, you know, I've spoken with a number of uh, SkySwitch team members here, and uh, they've pretty much echoed that sentiment. And um, by the way, looking forward to growing it two times more next year. Well, I'd like to grow it again. The great thing was when I walked around and looked at the exhibition hall that happened during lunchtime, we had to keep it open an extra half an hour because the lines were so long. Uh, one company reported that they were four deep from start to finish, which is a great sign of a trade show. You, know, you want to be four deep at the bar, well, you want to be four deep at the trade show. Companies like Poly and Grandstream and Jabra and Datto and a bunch of others were just telling us how great it was. And then there was Adaptive, where today they unveiled their white label solution that Sky Switch is going to be selling to our resellers for their Adaptive SD-WAN. And according to Bernard Betraton, and Todd Davis, there's been nothing but people all day long in their suite wanting to know more and more about SD-WAN. Absolutely, one, no question, one of the hottest topics uh, that we've been seeing you know, for the past year. And uh, I know that uh, both Bernard and, and, and Eric are really, really excited about that relationship. Um, you know, what else have you seen this morning? Well, I mean, when, about SD-WAN, a lot of people think it's just like a simple solution you can go out and deploy, and it's not. And in talking with Bernard on stage, we did a wonderful fireside chat. One of the things that he really brought home was that it's built for telecom and that they really optimize it for voice traffic. So I was really excited about that. I was also excited to see something get started that a mutual friend of ours has been really banging the drum on. We all know Jeff Dworkin for many years. Jeff's a fixture in the telecom community. For the past year, he's been working to launch something and we decided to give it a home here at SkySwitch's Vectors Conference, which is the Cloud Voice Alliance. Well, it's true, um, you know, and, and that it is a new organization and it does, it gives a voice to, you know, it's one of the themes that we saw here early today, um, you know, enables some of the smaller providers out there, some of the smaller resale, resellers to collaborate and strengthen their collective voice. And another thing that came out today was our advanced SIP trunking. Now, SIP trunking's been around for a long time. SIP trunking's not sexy. SIP trunking's not anything that's going to, you know, it's not new, but we've added a whole bunch of new twists that integrate our SIP trunking in with things like billing mm -hmm. that we do with ConnectWise. It, we've also announced that it's, it's more tightly woven into our overall platform. So our advanced SIP trunking solution is something that resellers can take forward and really drive home. And I, I think that you know one of the takeaways from that announcement is is it really echoes something that we've been hearing across the board that's important usability makes a usability makes the management of the platform and the interface a whole lot easier. Well, that's what we're all about: making it user simple, easy to use. I can't stress it enough. We're all about simple, and the more we can do to make it easy, the better we will. We also announced something new with uh, computer instru instruments, otherwise known as CI. We're going to be tying in with their IVR solution, which is known as a virtual concierge, known as E1. So when I look at all these different what's new and what's coming down the pike for our resellers in 2020, and they're all here today and tomorrow and Wednesday, and it's been nothing but packed. Eric Arneas and Jason Jones started it off. We kicked everybody off from the beginning to have just a great time. And here at the end of the day, almost 10 hours later, we're still going. And, and the excitement level really uh, from partners to Jason and Eric and, and, and even at the end of the day with you, um, you know, it's just uh, out of this world. Yeah, well, it's time to get ready, ready to party and have some fun. We'll be telling you all about the party, everybody, tomorrow, but let's just say it's going to be one heck of a day, man.
one heck of a day. Hey, Andy, great to see you. Uh, we'll do this again tomorrow. See you, Eric. Thank you. Thank you.